Did you know that beef cattle emissions are not driving global warming and you're being lied to? The answer is found in the biogenic carbon cycle. Plants absorb CO2 and produce carbs such as cellulose that are broken down by ruminants like cattle. A portion of the carbon is emitted from the cattle mainly by belching in the form of methane. After about 12 years, the methane is broken down into carbon dioxide in the atmosphere through hydroxyl oxidation. That is the same carbon that was in the air prior to being absorbed by the plants and eaten by the cattle. It is referred to as recycled carbon and the carbon is then absorbed by the plants again. This biogenic carbon cycle is a completely natural process. Additionally, a peer-reviewed study looked at white oak pastures regenerative practices and found an 80% reduction of net greenhouse gas emissions. In comparison to conventional practices, regenerative ones have up to a 66% lower GHG footprint. One thing is abundantly clear, ruminants are meant to graze our grasslands. Bison used to roam the land and have been replaced by cattle. Cattle increase soil water infiltration, nutrient availability, as well as organic matter content. They also sequester carbon, decrease soil erosion, and reduce the risk of wildfires. And here's my request for all the climate scientists, vegans, and meat haters out there. Get out of your city apartment, hop in your EV, and drive to a farm or ranch. Talk to the farmers and see how the cattle are the center of the regenerative ecosystems. You might be surprised by what you find and learn.